السلام علیکم گائز اٹس سبحان مشتبہ اگین فورتھ آف اپریل ٹوینٹی ٹوینٹی فور اٹ از اینڈ اٹس ٹیوزڈے یس آئی تھنک اٹس ٹیوزڈے لیٹ می کنفرم یا اٹ از ٹیوزڈے ہوپ فلی یو آل ہیئر می اوے فرام چارٹ فرام لاسٹ لائک ٹوینٹی تھرٹی ڈیز آئی واز بزی وتھ مائی پرسنل اسٹف اینڈ عید ہالی ڈیز آل آل اینڈ ہیو سم عید ہالی ڈیز ایز ویل سو دیر از نتھنگ مچ ہیپنڈ ان مارکیٹ ٹو بی آنیسٹ لائک آئی لیفٹ مارکیٹ سم ویئر March 24 where it is somewhere here in this zone I left here and then this pre-dempt happened so yes let's see what we have uh, right now few days back I marked and updated on Twitter as well we are making lower lows so short every bounce this supply rejected beautiful this internal liquidity is this one left yet didn't taken out but this one taken out beautifully one two three tap and then going good up we got our internal structure break beautiful liquidity is generating here on h4 so yes basically if you see that according to um, order block theory then it tapped here here so it should go up from this zone towards these levels but but keep in mind that from here structure shifted there are too much uh, too many things are aligning uh, with each other to go price to go down again let me show you now i'm clearing this chart i have two scenarios i will explain it later first if you uh, i will mark a few ranges here this is the whole فکرے رینج آئی ول کار لیٹ اے فکرے رینج ہیئر اوکے سو دس از مائی فکرے رینج وچ آئی ایم سینگ دیٹ بلو دس مڈ رینج وی آر گوئنگ ڈاؤن اینڈ اٹ اٹ ویری ویل ونس وی بریک ڈاؤن ریٹیسٹ آلموسٹ ریٹیسٹیڈ ہیئر اینڈ دین وی ٹیپ ہیئر رینج لوز these most of people are waiting here we front run just be because of this three tap set up here we created another equal lows here up go we retested here structure shifted now we are going up for time being may we are in the range like i will not say that we are going for 100k or we are going down <clears throat> for bearish scenario keep this level in your mind this is your level here if you want to be a bearish yes just flip this level break this level below here close daily h4 few h4 candles below here we are bearish then we are going down towards these levels i placed some stinky bids here if i was like if price is coming down there might be a chance that we wicked in this uh, uh, small Uh, demand here and then we go up but they front rent us uh, internally structure is now good structure is shifted here i didn't longed anything yet yesterday night i took a small scalp here with one of my friend then i shorted i shorted this price action right now i am in a short and i am targeting 65 600 why i shorted it i will tell you later so for now we have few ranges i will mark range in in a range look first this is biggest range like whole range i marked it this is your sr level flip this we are we will operate in this zone again this zone so simple is that flip this here h4 close h4 here This is your first scenario. Close H4 here. You are going up. 
if it deviated back then it's a short again but close h4 above 1 2 h4 above here then we are good to go towards upside because there is nothing in between these levels so it will go quickly up towards upside structure is also shifted here now i will remove this sr zone plus this range and i will come down towards this range because price is not behaving accordingly so we will have ton of things in our mind so this i mark this level this level so mid range is also acting as a sr flip as well and good zone here we flipped this uh, mid range here beautifully again higher high we are making now higher first we were making lower lows lower low lower high lower low lower high lower low lower high lower lows and now higher high higher low higher high higher lows are in making so i have now two three plans this this is temp this is the target 68 9 80 is the target of this range high for now so if i structure wise if i see higher high higher low higher high higher low making higher high higher lows but there is a tricky thing and i think there is a news aligned today as well so this is your BOS here before BOS we had this small little beautiful demand you call it order block whatever you want to call it so we left here we didn't tap in it and we are generating some liquidity as well so trend line liquidity is al also generating here so now the plan what i am looking at i am looking at this here to add if price gives me this zone structure wise if price gives me this zone i will add to my longs and i will hold according to the higher higher range first target will be this one but i will hold it towards highs because range lows are swept retested structure shifted so if you are trading a range and you you got some kind of like this structure like this price moves in it like here where it is price is moving like this in it and it deviates below structure shift so you are you add in this zone here to target mid range and range high simply i am doing like this so we got small deviations here and we left our few order block here so hopefully it goes up and then come down towards this level to fill me up and i will target range mid range and range highs bearish scenario or like if you want to be a bearish and turn bear from bull then you have to lose this level simple keep this level in your mind until unless we are above this level we are good to go towards upside there are more chances that we are going towards upside if we lose this on daily at least then we we are fucked up and we will be trading in this zone and we will targeting this zone yes there is a nice noise of 52k 57k yes it is possible but for that you have to breach certain levels and until unless they are not breached we are going up simple is that okay so now oh two ranges i have marked for now first range is this one range high so i will see a reaction here what will this uh, how will this zone reacts here because fair value gap is also here structure shifted here so there might chances we might take a pullback here towards this side but but there are chances that we didn't retest here so what we will do in this situation simple then formula is this is your supply as i said i shot it i shot it this supply from here i posted a twitter my stop is flat right now it might be stopped out 
on break even i don't know but in case if price doesn't give us these levels then the best will be this one flip here retest and then boom so flip will be the best one here this one you can add here your position you can took long position here so waiting from this flip of this supply something like it will be like it will go up like this bang no not this might reject here consolidate here and then boom you can add here you can you will wait to where if you want to add on retest you can add on retest as well so these are my two plans for longs one give me this level if you are not going to give me this level then at least at least flip this one and um, flip in like go flip fill this a fair value gap or absorb it give me a retest and i am a buyer on retest and i will look for long here stop will be yes this will be my stop whatever higher low will be that will be my stop some like this here and i will target might be i target this one might be here these levels whatever level you have you want to target these are then you are level so these are the two scenarios i am looking for why i am looking for i explained it to you you have sr zone here on a flip and you are in a range range lows are tapped structure shifted here liquidity is building here so there might be a chance that price came here to wick you out all longers those who place their stops in profit those who are longing this trend line get get out all those and then go up towards upside simple these are my two uh, bitcoin setups there is nothing much on bitcoin chart i don't think so um, for more what like if i if you want to draw uh, trend lines you can draw thousand of trend lines here there are thousand of trend lines are working one look at this one this one so these are i don't think so will work better to look objectively wait for range to play out wait for uh, structure to shift to in your direction then bet on it don't go against the trend trend is a bit bullish so don't short blindly yet yes you can short like my uh this was the level i will show you on another in another chart that is marked already why i shorted my short plan was like this is future chart here so simple i was looking at this uh, here on future chart look at this is my range i am looking at right now this was internal liquidity or ssl whatever you call it swept into straight into the h4 order block i place bids here and why i am targeting specifically this zone because these are the equal lows here at 65 600 right now i don't think so this will be hit look at this how close it came and it goes up in one candle so now third plan i might got stopped out or this might be a retest third tap here one tap two tap and third tap and then it come down so two plans i discussed one flip here or second one here now i will look for the third plan let me show you my third plan as well on bitcoin because there are thousands of levels we are looking at if you open monday range here there is monday range hello okay uh, 
sometimes beam levels didn't work i don't know why monday 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 okay it is not working right now let me um, check it on daily what the fuck i did here removing everything So this is your basically Monday. This is the Monday candle, this one. So this is Monday range here. Now come back to H4. This is your Monday low here. Look at how mid range. I didn't check this one. Okay. Mark again here. This one. This supply here. And now count with me structure shifted higher high higher low new higher high this is your higher low here so i will mark this order block higher low higher high equal highs are here higher low i will count this as a higher low and again new higher high so this is the higher high higher low here this order block so monday low is also here i will mark now monday low here this is a complicated a bit of complicated plan but monday low is somewhere here in this zone so this is internal bsl here okay now supply is this one it already it's uh, accepted here so now price if price came down here towards monday low stepped in a order block go up retest here and then we can again target monday high so you know you don't know whether market will give you a good uh, reaction or a big move in this week you never know so for lower time frame I will suggest this one if price gives you something like this here your stop will be here and target Monday high whatever Monday high this one this one previous week high this is previous week high so you can target this one as well so this is also a good 2.7 for our setup it is Today is some kind of news event as well. If you check out PUC of this range here. Okay, it is aligning beautifully with it. So this is also a third plan. Now let me show you lower time frame. Mm, but we got range here. So we crashed. We recovered. So whatever recovery it is, we will mark it as our range. We marked here. This is our range. Above range, we have supply. Beautiful. Order block here. Previous week high here. So, yes, there might be a chance that. Uh, and what, have, what was our uh, plan? Mandelo here. I think it was here. Market. Go for H1. No H4. Okay. Mark your order block here. Mark it perfectly here. And extend it here. So now look. Did it make sense or no? Yes, it makes totally a good sense here i will uh, i will keep eye on it this one and this you see also here in this demand here so i will add in my position here we'll target this range high again 2.9 are good r I will be out 
and now another plan what if price did like this what will you do here price goes up and came back that will be your deviation and look for some kind of structure here to shift the retail short that will be your short position stop will be here and you can target this one and you can hold it towards our first plan as well so three good plans are here on the card on bitcoin to short or long whatever you want to do this is the chart here and flip this supply flip this supply long towards highs come here retest here now you can place bids here as well with a stop here and the another uh, is uh, what I'm trying to say another thing is like if you don't want to place bid blind bids then wait for it to sweep this level go up on retest here you can place bids and your stop should be here and it will go up okay Make do you ask Karna? Make do you ask Karna? Right, sir. It's sad for you. Sorry, sorry, guys. It was. boss here boss was in my room uh, boss i mean my father so sorry for inconvenience so what i was saying yes okay so now uh second plan is like sweep this bsl and you have to you have to be very quick here because it will sweep it if it reclaimed then that this retest somewhere here will be quick you are then you can play stop accordingly like you want to play here you want to play here you can target here if you got stopped out here then this the plan one will work out here this one so too much uh, uh, going on the chart like look at this one look at the idea let me show you something let me show you something if you see there now it's look good this one looks good why if it break down here so shorter will be very active here retail they will short and come back here fuck them and looks good so yes let's see what's going on i will i am keeping bids here and then in case i got stopped out my plan 2 is also here so yes we'll see what's going on and if it flipped out here then that supply uh, that will be my beautiful long here okay so three ranges first one this one according to this we are at all this one if you show see you show you this one again this is also matching here with the mid range here and if you see this one we are at mid range so yes flip here many things are matching with each other in range trading you have to be like this like price is ranging okay we have two levels simple two levels don't complicate your life too much one level and this is your second level and 69 200 is your previous all time high you have to be marked if you you don't mark then remember it this is your previous all time high this will act as a resistance and support as well so now this is your range low range high so and you know that if you lose this level then you are bearish so at there why are you shorting blindly yes 
short with me like uh, with proper confluences otherwise don't show and this is your uh, ultimately it will tap i think now previous uh, all time high will tap here so there might be chance that in new york session it is going on new york is open so we might see a tomorrow today here some kind of flash here uh, might be a retest here so whatever given we are ready for our plan and we will execute accordingly this is your bitcoin chart now coming back to some other charts like ethereum and what i am looking at ethereum from daily perspective okay weekly there is a weekly demand here i marked it because the chart of ethereum and chart of bitcoin is a bit different uh, like they are not same so this is the huge range here if price somehow came in this zone that's a spot zone but bro that's a spot zone you can buy here and ethereum didn't tag first all time high yet so first tap deviation third tap is missing at 43.83 what i'm paying for that's why i mark this daily demand here uh, sorry weekly now what i'm looking at um, if you see this liquidity has been swept and we have a bus here lower low so this is your lower high zone what i marked i marked h4 fair value gap here so this is your range we have dumped recovery is your range so might be there might be a chance that price go up here and if it deviated in this range again then that is a short and you have clear liquidity pending here so you can target this liquidity here and if it holds up here in same like bitcoin then we can target these levels again so for ethereum i'm eyeing for this like small uh, deviation here if it given um, i have few other charts okay op i updated op this is my zone for spot but it didn't it ran up from 1.75 my bids were one at 1.65 somewhere 1.65 and 176 let me show you this is the op chart here sr flip it is so if it came here in this zone i will buy a small bag of op to hold and if it goes down i will dc it but i will hold i will start buying op here in this zone this looks good injective i already in a trade here from weekly order block so what i'm eyeing for injective is reclaim this this range it already reclaimed but it is not showing that much strength yet if we flip this level as well like then it will go up i will look for long here but for now yes looking good and target is this range high here until proven long it's a daily chart now we're looking on h4 and so closing above here will give me a, some kind of structure otherwise i will wait on injective where is uh, red list render so yes render if you saw a daily chart here previous higher high higher low again higher high this is higher low here we goes down then we reclaimed it beautifully so now what's my plan is my plan is, this is your daily demand you can buy if someone want to buy in a spot then yes this you can buy spot here daily if closes below here you can get out 
but for a scalp like long and short here this is your this is your blue zone here in this zone you can take your position like if you want a long hair yes this is this is where i will add um, yes this is where i will add stop will be like uh, h4 closes below here 6.3 percent stop wide stop but target will be 10.3186 will be the target render here mm, another i have one another coin as well in the list i don't know which one it was but i have another one as well when we when we was a spot boy here but i didn't look into it mm, i think it was a fill i don't know someone asked me about a coin now i didn't trim okay they fill here yes i think it was a fill fill did <laughs> did a breakout retest and when we were in a bull run Till did this h4 h4 also looks good Fill. so you can add here from here to here and stop is this one and this whole gap it might it it will be filled at least half so you can target this level as well fill here and uh, but where is the another coin FET I think it was yes I am looking at FET I marked this these levels on FET on daily now sorry it is also on a weekly I think 12 hour chart it is I don't know but I marked this one but I didn't took any of FET I don't know why but I messed up I think it's H4. Yes, it's H4. I didn't took anything. Now it is reclaiming this level. This is very important level. So once it reclaimed it, what will the this is the confirmation here. I'm waiting for close above here to make higher high. Then somewhere here on a retest, we can I will long it. Stop will be here. And I will target like levels, same levels above, whatever level is given above. Like this is the level, these are the equals. So I will target those. Or if the good day, like if volatility is there and market behaves well, then this will be my final target 3.129. So, yes, on FET, I'm looking at here. Uh, we have, I have Ethereum plan for short. And yeah, I am already in it and waiting for this level to reclaim here properly. Once it reclaimed it, then I will start trading it. I was um, already in it. FET, I'm waiting, waiting, waiting. Render, yes, if some kind of hook rate came in in market, like if price dropped, then I will buy it. Render, so soul. So um so not interested that much. I was looking at it, but it is not that much interested yet. It is also making same pattern. Look at this one. Ladder up, ladder up, ladder up, and in one candle elevator down and whatever these fair value gaps and these zones are not filled they will build up built fuel and then they will go up so now this is what i have from bitcoin burgers started to pump again bitcoin look at this i got i didn't i am still in it okay i will hold it i will hold it yes i will hold my position yet 
hopefully it come down so this is what i have on oh, last chart yes the important one mm. it's a usdt dominance if you are following me you know that i have what i have uh, on usdt dominance this demand do you remember this demand this demand playing all the fukri here so now lower time frame if you see that from daily sorry we tapped this uh small supply here one tap two three tap then we came down now this is your order block here we had this liquidity here now if you see this is zone and it is beautifully like here it is your bos msb from weekly order block so if it tapped here it will be like this it will again run hard once it loses it then bitcoin is going to all time high until unless once bit uh, you keep eye on it uh, usdt dominance once it reach to this order block, then be careful in longing. Then don't long. Wait for breakdown here, some kind of bearish scenario here. Until unless it, it is holding here, don't long then. So if USDT dominance reached to this, uh, to its like order block, Bitcoin will be at range highs again. Somewhere here, somewhere here. So that's a good zone for short because we are ranging uh, we are ranging so better where is the chart the heritage so then better to short the like this is your previous uh, all time high 69200 so yes if usdt dominance reach to its place then it will be somewhere here and resistance again it will be came into a resistive zone so there might be a chance that we can go down again because these internal lower lows uh, are not good and if price suddenly go up in towards these zones then there uh, the order block where was the order block somewhere here then this will be very important because when price will came to it um, nobody will um, take a risk on it it is valid until unless it breached down so yes keep eye on it keep eye on usdt dominance different alts uh, someone today told me that dot atom and avx they will be like going good but for now i checked atom avx there is nothing same same scenario going on so yes only bitcoin chart looks a bit good and like mm, we have some kind of scenario we can produce on bitcoin but on alts if bitcoin dropped a bit alts will again die for 20 30 percent so don't bet on alts rather to bet on bitcoin for now because slowly market is a bit slow not that much good yes a strength is coming back to market like look at these candles good candle then slow bleed then good candle slow bleed again good candle slow bleed now again making a good candle here so strength is here but if price came down towards this level this is our first level of interest again here and lip of this one so we have plan and execute your plan yes if it stopped out then you are wrong simple is that if it worked out it will give you a good rr like all all setups are of are of like uh, 3r to 2.9r 2.7r so it's a good rr it will give you a good uh, what uh, we say uh, results
and let's see how things will move on from here and for now from my side a quick this is a quick update here so yes FET keep eye on FET pet it will blast it will blast like once it re cleared this area this one because it is rejecting from here once it clear it it will go quickly up so keep eye on it and ethereum i have plan given you and bitcoin so yes these three for trading and until unless we didn't say anything else i will update on twitter and on discord as well so till then trade safe don't stuck in chop like this this is now chop you see that if you come down to 15 level m15 lower time frame you will be stuck in it because it <coughs> it is acting in only two levels so if you are good in scalping yes then do it but if you are not good in scalps and then wait for the proper confirmation on h4 at least on h1 and then uh, trade accordingly thank you for tuning till end see you in next uh, video inshallah that will be also soon uh, till then allah hafiz hopefully market gives us uh, easy and good setups for the remaining of the week allah hafiz